Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the D Rich Show, where we talk anything and everything crypto. Now, here's your host, D Rich. Hey everybody, welcome back to the D Rich Show. This is D Rich and today is Thursday, September 16th, 2021. How's everybody doing thus far this day? I hope you guys are all well and this video finds you all in good health, good spirits, and good energy. So first off, uh, we're going to cap this uh, Solana ecosystem network up today with Solana sell as this is the last token that I actually hold in that ecosystem. So I wanted to cover uh, my bases on all of those tokens that um, are in my portfolio regarding Solana and its ecosystem. But most definitely before we get started, I want to make sure that I acknowledge every single one of you that is uh, subscribed to the channel coming along with me on the journey. So thank you so much for those folks who have been here. Thank you for continuing to support the channel. And continue to follow along so you guys are most definitely greatly appreciated and um, thank you so much uh, without further ado let's go ahead and get into the bitcoin dominance at 41.4 percent while ethereum is sitting at 19.5 with a global crypto market cap of 2.17 trillion not too bad uh, as far as the decrease is concerned at 0.06 percent over the last 24 hours then you have some trending tokens shibu you know smooth love potion Firo or Firo, and then you also have some biggest gainers here, which is uh, Zenon Pay, X2P, Bank Social, BSL, and Galaxy Games Gala, which is up 203.74%. And if you've been following on me on the channel, you know that I've discussed Gala um, in detail with its uh, connection with the Flare network and ecosystem. So um, I hope that you were able to get in on Gala Games um, because of the uh, explosion that just came out of nowhere and then um, I hope that you are enjoying your nodes on Galaxy Games as well. So anyway, there was some recently added tokens which is Cryzen Network, KRN, and Nether NFT which is NTR and Gibbic Swap. So I don't know anything about those so we won't go into them. But this is a new feature on the coin market cap where it allows me to have a little more talking points here on the video. So anyway, Bitcoin right now forty eight thousand eighty dollars eighty one cents. Ethereum at three thousand six hundred and twenty dollars forty nine cents. While Cardano's placed at number three two dollars forty four cents. While um, Binance Coin BNB four hundred and twenty five dollars forty four cents. And our beloved XRP is at a dollar ten. So again. At this rate, at this stage, you can continue to accumulate, acquire as much XRP um, as you can, and um, it wouldn't hurt you that much. But again, if it continues to de uh, decline in value, I highly encourage you to get in and most definitely pick up some XRP as your bottom line, like I have done, uh, most definitely. So Solana, $155.17. Um, still is sitting at number seven, which is not bad. So if you are dollar cost averaging into Solana, I encourage you to continue to do so. If you lost faith um, in Solana based on the uh, situation that occurred a couple of days ago, well, um, you know what? Sometimes you want to kind of hold your position until uh, proven otherwise. Now, if it drops a little bit further for me, I'm still not going to do anything because I'm bullish. And I'm happy about my position there. Polkadot is at $35.04 at number nine, eight, excuse me, and Dogecoin at number nine, 24 cents. And USDE rounding out the top 10, still at a $29 billion market cap, while Uniswap is at $26.69. And if we look down the market, you got AVAX here, which we've discussed before. On the channel 21.23 percent in the last 24 hours so i'm excited about those gains coming my way for both on galaxy games as well as avalanche so anyway algorand up seven percent two dollars 18 cents and then you can scroll down you got red 
green here and there, mostly uh, red, but that's okay. Those are buying opportunities before you get into those assets that you've been keeping your eyes on or, well, or as well as accumulate and acquire your favorite currencies or digital assets. So there, um, I want to go ahead and scroll down just a little bit more so that you guys are able to see what's going on in the market and see uh, where we're at on some of these projects. Okay, but I don't want to spend too much time because here um, on Coin Market Cap as well, this is the Solana, top Solana ecosystem to, uh, tokens by Cap uh, Market Capitalization, and most definitely, um, I'll leave this in the description. I'm not going to get into it too much um, because at the end of the day, we want to get right into the video, which is talking about Solana Cell. And here from Coin Gecko, uh, let me go ahead and give that a refresh. So you get the aggregate price for us to check out. Okay, so right now it's at 49 cents, 40, almost 49 and a half cents there at uh, 1,077 in the coin market cap rank. So again, um, this was just listed on BitTrue, which we'll get into here shortly. And um, their website is solanacell.com or solanacell.medium.com. And then you also have their explorers on Solana and SoulScan. And you can find their community on Reddit, Twitter, and Discord.gg. And here is their source code on GitHub. And their APID is sell there. So you can click to copy that link there or check that out. And then you also have some tags, which is token and Solana ecosystem. And then most definitely, we want to get into the price and market stats, which is going to uh, determine uh, if we see some downward momentum, upward momentum, or is it trading sideways? Um, at the moment, it looks like we are trading in between uh, certain ranges, uh, most definitely 49 cents as a low, 48 cents as a 20, uh, 24 hour low, 62 cents as a 24 hour high, and a seven day high of 93 cents. So again, if you are getting into a position, um, whether you get in and it decreases in value, then at that point in time, you know that you're going to have to dollar cost average to continue to acquire, accumulate. And this is one of the tokens that I do know that I'm going to have to continue to acquire just to get to a certain position where I know that I'm comfortable with how many I have in the portfolio. And, you know, sometimes the uh, bigger amount uh, that you hold will return uh, better rewards on your investment. So say for instance, hypothetically, if you have 10,000 tokens versus 5,000, obviously 5,000 is going to net you $50 per penny. But if you have 10,000 or more, then you can obviously believe that uh, 10,000 is going to get you um, about a hundred bucks per penny. Okay. Um, am I wrong? I might be wrong on that. It might be five bucks to 10 bucks if I'm not mistaken. So um, I apologize if I'm mistaken. Hmm. 10,000, 10 bucks, I think it is. But you know, at the end of the day, and I'm sorry if I'm, I'm confusing myself here, but anyway, all time low there is April 15, 2021, which was about a month ago. And it's up to 25,769.5% with an all time high of 94 cents, which was about seven days ago. So again, kind of keep your eye on it as far as your positioning. Okay. Um, so you don't want to jump in too early, but you don't want to jump in too late. And in the last 30 days, you got a 2,400 increase in the value on that return there. And then most definitely you can go ahead and purchase that on BitTrue as well as Radium, which we've talked about earlier this week. I'm satisfied with my Radium position and the Ken position that I hold as well as my Solana. The only other uh, position uh, that I'm uh, needing to add on to is um, what is the token that we've discussed this week. We'll get into that. I'll make sure that I remind myself because sometimes when I'm thinking too fast, I might not necessarily get into all of what I need to get into. So anyway, here you want to follow them on Twitter. Okay. And 
this is at Solana Cell, Cell, which is the first community token fully distributed on Solana and G Cell, Solana Cell governance token. And here again is their website and their Discord there. And then most definitely check out their latest and greatest news. Solana Cell is officially featured in, which is a startup listed on the web seven website and it also confirms that we will attend the biggest and best European tech event which is the web summit of 2021 so the other token just came to my mind which is rope so there's two tokens Solana sell sell and rope are two of the tokens that I do hodl um, for me to improve my position so I want to improve my position on those two the other ones that we've discussed Solana itself uh, can radium I'm happy with those positions there uh, so anyway um, go ahead and check their Twitter feed out look at the greatest news that they come out with so that you can actually get it from the horse's mouth but without further ado let's go to their website which is SolanaCell.com let's make sure that we are at the right point so we can get into it so this is uh, Solana Cells uh, again powered by Solana which is the first ever community SPL token that is built on Solana which is also fully distributed randomly 21 million max supply so again has the same amount of tokens as uh, Bitcoin so if you are looking at a lower uh, max supply when it comes to tokens this is one of those that you should keep your eye on not saying it's going to reach Bitcoin prices. That is not what I'm suggesting or recommending. What I'm saying is sometimes when you have a shorter supply, uh, demand actually grows a lot faster and quicker. All sell token supply has been released for free to the community. And instead of conducting an airdrop by releasing part of the supply and kept remaining for different purposes, all sell were released randomly. Then you can also trade sell token here. Sell is available for trading on the following exchanges. Again, you got Lana Dex, Fabric, Solap, oh, Sol Ape, excuse me, Cato, Hams Dex, Aldrin, Sonar, Dex Lab, Pigeon Dex, as well as BitTrue here. So trade G Cell token on these exchanges here. G Cell is available for trading on the following exchanges. And most definitely, you want to go ahead and check those out. And then here are some wallets that you can actually uh, sell as feature on the following wallets, Phantom, Coin98, uh, Solid, as well as Math. And then here are some tokenomics and airdrop. Again, 21 million of sell tokens. Airdrop is now complete, but the Solana Cell ecosystem is a huge project and it will also take time to build it, but the challenge is really promising. So again, here you can download their white paper and here on the channel, I always encourage you to do so, whether you download it, print it out, or refer back to it. Preferably, you print it out as like a pamphlet where you can jot down your notes as you are either listening to my videos or other folks who are talking about Solana Cell so you can get different information from different sources, compare your notes, and contrast your notes, and see where you, know, you fit in with the uh, idea that this should actually be in your portfolio or refer back to your notes at some point in time to uh, refresh your memory or jog your memory as sometimes our memory fails as we've seen today on today's video with myself. Okay, so here's sell airdrops progress, which is 100% complete. Sell token circulation supply, which is 21 million. And then no more sell token minting will take place and then G Cell airdrop snapshot July 1st, 2021. So if you are in this token, you are getting um, some airdrop snapshots there. And then there are some sell tokenomics. Again, there are some advisors that will need to be updated. Team needs to be updated. And then marketing, there's none actually um, going to the team. 0%, 0%, 0%, and advisors, 0% as well. And then the airdrop is 100% of the total supply. And then here are some G-Cell tokenomics, which is 10 million. Okay, advisors get 300,000 LPS staking yield farming. Uh, you get 4 million there, which is 40%. Then you got 3 million, which is 30% on an airdrop. And then the team gets 1.2 million, 12% there. 
and then marketing also gets 1.5 million, which is 15% of that total uh, tokenomics and total supply there for G-Cell. And then here you have G-Cell vesting schedule and supply. So again, you look at these here um, and coordinate it with how that's going to uh, take place for their advisors team, the marketing growth airdrops, and the LPS, or LPS staking yield farming circulating supply and then max supply so you can check that out there and then you can also track your cell and g cell tokens track sale and g cell among your know, farming and liquidity pool performance on solana blockchain with sonar then you can check your cell and g cell on a board which is the cross chain DeFi dashboard there and sell and g cell position tracking for DeFi power users which is native to solana step and get the latest both sell and G-Sell price real-time chart, volume, market cap, info, markets, and more. So you got nomics, okay, sell nomics or genomics, if I'm not uh, mistaken. And then you also have coin gecko here, coin gecko there for those two. And then also the coin market cap there and coin market cap there for G-Sell. So anyway, Solana Cell ecosystem is this. Cell will be the main utility token of a new ecosystem built on Solana and sell staking to get G cell uh, when available will be available in phase two. G cell will be the Solana cell ecosystem token on four platforms, which is governance, vaults, DeFi, as well as NFTs marketplace. And G cell staking feature will be available on phase one and the community will be able to stake G cell and get G cell rewards. So if we're all about staking, getting some return on our investment, whether it be minimal or maximal. Uh, we want to make sure that we capitalize on every opportunity that some of these tokens provide for us. So you got Solana Cell, their ecosystem, Cell is their token, governance, SPL token governance platform. Then you got the vaults here for Cell ecosystem and SPL tokens. And then you got G-Cell, which is DeFi, borrowing, lending, yield farming as well as NFTs, which is open sell NFT marketplace. And most definitely G cell airdrop allocation goes as this. There's going to be a airdrop total of 3 million G cell tokens, which is, which has already started July 1st, 2021 and decentralized exchange wallets excluded of snapshot. Okay. So if you didn't get in, which I did not, so I won't be getting any out airdrop allocations, but hopefully, that changes in the future um, when it comes to different allocations per month. So you got a project roadmap here and the roadmap also focuses on the development of the technology, operations, infrastructure, new partnerships and marketing initiatives. And here in quarter two, 2021, Solana Cell Ecosystem Concept Cell was launched. Social networks has been launched on Twitter and Discord. And then you also have their website launched, which we are on now. And G-Cell tokenomics and G-Cell airdrop allocation has also been published. And then you also have the quarter three for Solana Cell ecosystem deployment, which is phase one. You got the G-Cell launch, G-Cell airdrop, and then the marketing partnership phase one and G-Cell governance platform beta version. And then within quarter four, you're going to have the Solana Cell ecosystem deployment in phase two and the marketing partnership in phase two you got the web summit and then you got cell vault platform beta version and then you got g cell governance platform mainnet and then here moving into 2022 quarter one solana cell ecosystem deployment which is phase three you got the vault platform mainnet you also have marketing partnership phase three then the DeFi platform beta version and then you got the sell open sell NFT marketplace VETA version as well. And then within quarter two, Solana Cell Ecosystem Deployment Phase 4, Cell DeFi Platform Beta Mainnet, Cell Open Cell NFT Marketplace Mainnet. So those things should be going live in quarter two of 2022. So again, if you are a believer in the ecosystem of Solana, go ahead and hold your position, see what it's worth, see the value on your return at those times before you make a decision to either continue on with hodling or make a different move. I think that 
by the end of it all, you're going to be satisfied uh, with making a decision and hodling your position. So why Solana sell? A whole new uh, token deployment approach. Sell cannot be considered as a security and people are free to buy or sell on one of the best decentralized exchanges, which is Soul, Ape, Finance, Fabric, Lana, Cato, Pigeon, Ham, Sonar, and Decentralized Exchange Lab. And then most definitely you can read the mission there. I'll leave that for you to do. All of this will be left in the description. And then again, it is also proudly built on the ultimate blockchain platform, Solana. And then here is some latest Solana news, some tweets by Solana Cell. You can read that. I'm not going to do any of that for you today. But most definitely this thing goes down for you to check out all of that. And here are some frequently asked questions. And if you got questions about Cell or the ecosystem and the airdrop related to questions, we are have um, they have got the answers. Check it out. What does SPL stand for? That means Solana Program Library, which is SPL, is a collection of on-chain programs targeting the C-level parallel runtime. And these programs are tested against Solana's implementation of C-level Solana runtime. And it is also deployed to its mainnet. As others implement C-level, Solana will graciously accept patches to ensure the programs are here as uh, portable across the uh, all implementations. And then do you have bulk discounts? Nope. There's 20 million of sell tokens airdrop, which is now complete, but the sell ecosystem is a huge project and it will take time to build it, but the challenge is really promising. So again, sometimes it takes time to be patient, to persevere through anything. So again, uh, when you're brand new with something, you gotta give it time to develop. Nothing is going to happen fast. Sometimes we want things fast, and I understand that, but sometimes we gotta learn to be patient and learn to persevere through any market. So when is your airdrop that will start? Airdrop took place again on May 2021, which was fully distributed. The 21 million of the tokens, 100% of the supply randomly across the community, and the team didn't keep not, none or receive any token. And what are the mint addresses for our token? You got the sell mint address, which is here. And then you got G-Cell Volume 2 mint address there. So any questions, go ahead and contact them. And as always, you want to make sure that you leave your email so that they can get back to you. Or you can get the news straight to your email. So again, Solana Cell is the fastest and most scalable digital asset, enabling real-time global payments and decentralized finance, governance, false, and NFT marketplace anywhere in the world. So again, here are some links there for Twitter, Discord, Telegram. I don't know these other two as well as this, well, that's Reddit, I don't know that one uh, per se. So then again, you can contact them, you got a job, there you go. And then marketing team and founder there. And then here are some quick links for their tokenomics as well as their world map again. So moving forward with the last article of the day, Solana Cell, which has been listed on, on Bitroot, the listing and yield farming at 90% APR. This was about 10 days ago. Dear Bitruers, as you guys know, Bitrue is my favorite platform available. And after successfully passing through our BTR votes process, Cell, Solana Cell is coming to Bitrue today. Cell will be the main utility token of a new ecosystem built on Solana. It would also be used for G-Cell, D-Cell, V-Cell, and N-Snail. Um, holding Cell will give more power features on all Cell ecosystem platforms, and their governance, Vault, DeFi, and NFT platform will be launched in quarter four, 2021, quarter one, 2022. And for more information, uh, they can be found on their official website here, which we just discussed. And the deposits for this coin has already been enabled. So if you are an existing holder of this coin, you can deposit now and be ready for when trading starts um, with a USDPT pair on September 6th. And withdrawals for the coin will be enabled approximately 24 hours after trading begins. And we are very pleased to be working with Solana Cell to bring our communities a chance to receive returns of up to 90%. 
APR with yield farming. So again, I do believe that if you are holding a Solana cell in BitTrue, you're going to have the opportunity to get in that returns on those uh, staking rewards. Uh, this round will have two pools opening, both of them rewarding GSAL. The details are as follows. So it's September 7th and BTR and sell. So again, if you hold BTR token, it allows you to vote. And in the process of voting period, it will give you some tokens in return for absolutely free. And it pays again to hold BTR tokens in there. So I've done it with Legacy or L, excuse me, LGCY and um, SHXX on Bitru. So, you know, that's something that I've been doing and I'm also getting free stuff in return. And the farming period will be up for a full 30 days and there will also be a preparation and distribution periods at the beginning and end of the investment. Yo farming is only available on the Bitru app, which can be downloaded for Google Play and iOS App Store. And just look for the DeFi section on the front page and make sure you turn it up 10% UTC on September 7th, as these investments also often sell out extremely quickly. So again, um, with that being said, go ahead and do your due diligence, come to your own conclusions, use discernment when dealing with certain assets. You know, I'm never a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I'm only demonstrating to you what I'm doing. So if you want to follow, um, you're more than welcome to do so, but it's not mandatory. So again, um, you want to build your portfolio how you see fit. If you want to um, decrease the amount of crypto you hold, that is entirely up to you. But most definitely, um, you want to make sure that you are uh, growing your uh portfolio as best as possible so again i wanted to go to twitter here because i wanted to go back to something that i posted the other day and then here is warren buffett's 10 rules and the first rule is number one reinvest your profits so what i've done is actually pulled that up on uh, learn uh, repeat academy uh, dot com where i found the actual um article on this and this number one is reinvest your profits and i'll read it before i wrap up today's video buffett's biography by alice schrader is titled the snowball which illustrates the effect of compounding tiny additions over the long term result in huge gains the profits generated from the investments are invested back again and over the long term this can lead to huge gains without doing much work reinvesting your profit is a form of delayed gratification that is really tough to see in the short term. And on a personal level, these profits can also be spent away. It literally pays to be mindful of the opportunity costs you might incur by spending the profits. But even in non-financial terms, doubling down on what you what is working would lead to compounding effects. Sticking to a skill that you are good at, again, literally pays when the skill is carefully developed over time and investing and reinvesting in your skill sets will compound over time which is tough to see clearly in the short term so again reinvest your profits whether that means again doing something that you're good at i try to stick to what i'm good at if i don't understand technical analysis or charting i'm going to stay with away from it because i don't want to uh, do something that screws me up I'm good at information. I love digesting it and trying to understand it so that I can present it to people out there in the crypto community, whether you are subscribed to the channel or not, then it gives someone else to think about something totally different because I think a little bit different because right here at number two, be willing to be different. So this is why on this channel, we talk anything and everything crypto um, because crypto is going to be a huge uh, thing that we have no idea what it will come to. It's going to be a plethora of different things coming in. Again, you had DeFi, your traditional cryptocurrencies, you got meme tokens, you got uh, staking rewards, yield farming, you got uh, nodes, you got everything. So, again, um, always be willing to be different. Do yourself, be yourself, and always uh, 
have trust and faith in who you are because again I believe that everyone has their own personal genius it's just got to learn to tap into it so again ladies and gentlemen I hope that you enjoyed today's video on Solana sale wrapping up the tokens that I hold in the Solana ecosystem in my portfolio personally I'm always truthful honest transparent so I want to make sure that you are seeing what I do just from watching the video hear me out and see how it works for you have a great rest of your day we're almost at the end of the week tomorrow we'll get into some just basic crypto news I'll go over some things that have been happening in the traditional markets as well as the crypto markets some of the news with the ripple lawsuit things like that we want to touch base we want to uh, touch base on some of the price appreciation with the uh, H bar, some of those things. Uh, most definitely, we'll re re go over that in tomorrow's video um, to wrap up the week. So, anyway, again, have a wonderful rest of your day, whether it be morning, noon, or night. We'll talk to you tomorrow. God bless. Take care. And as always, treat everyone with class, dignity, and respect. Bye bye.